guys, I've just come out for a mountain bike today because I saw a fire engine uh, in my local woodland and I've just had a chat to the firemen and they're telling me that uh, there's been uh, several small fires in the woodland but uh, the fire engine's gone but look at this whoever's done this fire has created a massive smouldering mess so my battery is about to go but the only thing to do now is to bust open the water, do a digging stick and try and get this sorted and it's just spread man, it's spread from there, that way, this way, all through here all round here and all down there so I'll probably say square meters probably 30 40 square meters this is what happens when you don't do things properly and uh, these guys people you know give people like us a bad name Right, I've got this part all under control now and it's out. All here. Basically I just dug further back so I killed the fuel source for it. Still smouldering a bit. The hottest parts are uh, right at the bottom. Right people, is the finished article. Put it out completely. It's taken a lot of work though. So, you know, I feel good actually. So as you can see, uh, someone's in the uh, tent over there. I can hear them in there, uh, but they're not going to—they're not going to open the zip to me. Uh, at the moment, I've got two more little fires now to put out all again, and the whole area here is burnt. So uh, it's the next day guys, and I'm back out here again. Um, tried to put it out last night, it was just far too much. Uh, the fire brigade as well, we're not really interested. They said just to let it burn out. Um, it's been torrential rain today, and it's still going. I've just come for a mountain bike around the place and I can still smell smoke in the air. So no amount of rain is gonna get rid of this. Um, so I'm gonna try and finish the job off now. I don't know if you can make that out on film um, but it's burning right into the heart of the root sort of inside <laughs> one down and uh, just on cue another one's popped up So 
So guys, uh, crisis averted and all the fires have been put out now. Uh, but I've learnt quite a bit on this. I've never seen uh, fires going underground like that before. I mean, I think I've put them all out now, but you just don't know. I mean, it's the one that you've just seen that just came out of nowhere. Um, you just don't know. So I'm going to keep an eye on this over the next three or four days. Uh, make sure that it's completely gone because it's decimated this woodland. It's killed a lot of trees already and I don't want it to... I mean, this is an ancient woodland and it's my local woodland, so, you know, I want to help protect it. And now uh, it was all the fault of this prick. So guys, keep safe and keep your woodland safe and look after yourselves. See ya.